You are fast. <laughs> It's a tough night, not just for me. Really tough night. Well, Thanks to Abstruse, the Abstruse winner. Uh, I think we've got it working again. Turns out that uh, it turns out that you are right. That there was a apparently the the version served by GOG has a corrupt file that you have to substitute with the one from the the CDs. So I I did that. I haven't played it, but I did I did manage to load it. It seemed to work. So we'll see what happens. Could be a short one though. the unnecessarily loud computer sounds, okay. Thank you. Thank you, Jacob. <laughs> it's driving me crazy, my hair. I've never had it this long before, and it drives me nuts every second of every day. It's too long. I can't afford a haircut. And I'm too lazy, and I have too much anxiety to go get one. Who did I keep dreading? Who, who is the jinxed one? Hippie? Let's see. I can't even remember what the mission... I just saw the mission. Billy. Okay. I'm just looking at the chat room. Every time I look off to the side like this, that's the chat room. Even though I should be looking up, because that's where you are. <laughs> See? We already got further than we did before. Ah! I may need to turn it down for my own health here. <laughs> Actually, yeah, I definitely will. Ah! One second. Nothing is ever easy. Figures. I don't know if it's lowered for you guys, but <laughs> it's better for me now. I look kind of pale. Uh, that's just the light. I am pale. I don't. I. I never go outside. Man, we got some heavy dudes coming at us now. <laughs> Bro. Break formation and open fire. I could negotiate. Oh, sucker! 
two! Two kills! One pass! Did you see that? Oh! Oh, it's a curse being this good! Get cocky. Why not? Check out my rear view. My right view. Oh, that's check engine soon. Those shouldn't be coming out. Why did that happen? I have no idea why that happened. Something just turned the mute on all my my little levers there. My volume levers. I am so sorry. Well, whoever's fucking with me, knock it off. Stop fucking with my levers. Give me a damage report. Everything's cool here. Bro. Must have been a hotkey, I don't know. I got too cocky and my my levers died. <laughs> what is with the Marines? Come on! You guys are killing me. You're just killing me. Can I help you in any way? Thank you, True Shot. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Uh, should I be doing something? Like... Are you hitting the fucking gift shop or what? Uh-oh. Hippie, what are you doing? Hippie, stop crashing into the space lab. This tin can's all ours, Colonel. We'll take it from here. Mission complete. Hippie. Need clearance. Captain Paulson passes on his congratulations. I don't like that guy. You have clearance. That, that guy over there. I just don't think I'd like him in real life. 
Thank you, Scotty. Well, looky what we have here. <laughs> Back to the future. <laughs> How would you like to... What's, 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 what's the ear canal? What's, 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 what's... Well, since when did you become the physical type? Ah, they see us! ...regarding the escalating tensions between the frontier worlds and the Confederation. The Union of Border Worlds, as they now call themselves, indicate they remain at peace with the Confederation. But the Confed bylaws and constitution no longer govern... Future TVs! ...in response, the Great Assembly has decreed yeah, uh, that yeah. Border World vessels can no longer yeah. operate within Confed territory unless... Yeah, keep mugging, Tom. Escorts. We go now live to Admiral Jeffrey Tolwyn at Confed HQ. Admiral. What's up? Good evening, everyone. Uh, for weeks now, we've been experiencing an increasing harassment of legitimate Confed space operations. I'm afraid innocent people are being murdered, and chaos is the result. Until we bring these perpetrators to justice, I'm afraid we must monitor all traffic flying under a different flag. We will build a wall! The Union of Border Worlds and the Confederation come to terms? Well, Barbara, what other choice do we have? Thank you, Admiral. Do you want a video game or not? Ah! Next up, the scores for the Galactic Cricket Cup. Uh-oh, Mark's locked up. Looks like he's rethinking his career. <laughs> foosball! Why is there not a foosball minigame? It's like right there. Right there. The old one's right. Confed has to do whatever it takes to maintain order. Otherwise, you got everybody going off half cocked. The border worlds have been dumped on ever since the war ended. This required chaperoning is just going to turn up the heat. <laughs> That'll thank the lucky stars that ain't the Kalrathi bossing them around. Like a lot of people think it was the border worlds who kept us in the war long enough for the colonel here to lower the boom. What are you Your looking at, butthead? Year, real close to the border worlds. You think they should be forced to fly under escort? <laughs> I don't know. I'm just here to get hammered. What, does Confed need to clamp down or are they abusing their authority? Clamp down. <laughs> I, I, I don't want to be supporting the wall. Then again, then again, let's be clear here. I did just see a border worlder blow up a space station with 3,000 people on it. Shit's out of hand. Confed needs to clamp down. We've done pretty well with Confed in charge. You gotta think about the victims of this terrorism. Word. Namaste. What do you think will happen to the captain? <laughs> Who cares? He's been holed up in his cabin since this whole Paulson thing started. I mean, I, I'm sick of the whole thing. Let's go visit him. Thank you, Retro Station. Enter. I'm glad you like the Ultima series. It's probably oh, my best home. work. Very proud of it. Good to see you. Now get out. <laughs> Guess now you'll have more time to answer your mail. Captain Paulson said something about new orders. I'm awaiting a transfer. That's the extent of my orders. Oh, come on, sir. Someone's going to wake up and rescind this decision. Confed's a different place today. Running a spaceship is a different job than it used to be. Who knows? Maybe they're doing me a huge favor. Now, I appreciate your concern, Colonel. <laughs> I get paid either way. <laughs> the old man is looking forward to new challenges. Future endeavors. Ho! 
Yes, sir. Hey, don't go. I got Xbox. You've got mail. Oh, tell him you love him. Uh, jerk. No one will play foosball with me. Why is the telescope looking into the ladies' room? Well. <laughs> Exemplary work on the space lab, Colonel. Thank you, sir. Rescuing it and the biochemist will be of tremendous benefit to Confed's plans. But not a business at hand. Now, can you show me how to work this thing? The Border this, World this Union brazenly defies Confed's airspace edict. We approach one such outlaw convoy now. Military ships that have invaded Confed's territory and maneuver with no Confed escort. They have ignored orders to turn back and have even taken pot shots at Confed's forces. Kill them all! A grave threat. All of them! The can no longer be tolerated. We shall issue one more warning. If they refuse to cooperate, you are to enforce the interdiction, Colonel, by any means necessary. Dismissed. Oh, crap. What'd I do? Oh, I had a timer set. What? Uh. <laughs> what ship we got now? Whoa! We got the heavy artillery. Okay. Oh, we keep getting new guys. Uh, there's fish, fish, quality, who looks just like hippie to me. Primate is, has deserted the ship. Miner is sick. Vero, who looks surprised to have her picture taken. Steel. Oh, <laughs> he looks hard as nails, man. I want steel. It's green egg and hammet. <sighs> Can you steal? Attention, Border Worlds contingent. You are in violation of Confed. Nah, 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 nah. This is your final warning. Turn back and leave Confed airspace or heave to for proper escort. You have illegally apprehended a Border World space lab. We have no intention of heeding orders from thieves. Well, okay then. Break formation and open fire. <laughs> Time to show them. Oh. Oh shit. Make sure I get He's already toast. Any last request? Oh, steel left me. Ah! I could use some backup. Inescapable Tim. Ah! Whee! Ah. Who's next? You guys. You won't see tomorrow. Fuck, that's a lot of guys. Ah! <laughs> I really need backup! I 
Not the great heart of the tiger! Jesus Christ! Knock it off! Whoa! Next! Gotta run out of guys eventually, in theory. Come on. Bye bye. You damn right. Mission complete. First, give me your wallets. Is Farad here? Hello, Farad. I hope you picked up steel. <laughs> Need clearance. Captain Paulson's pleased with your performance, Colonel. He's pickled his punch. I just killed a lot of people. <laughs> well, I filled my flight suit, but it worked out. Allez cuisine. Can I ask you something, Colonel? What's up, Marty? What's Harrison Ford like? Attacking that convoy? Is... Is this the way wars start? Let me tell you something, Cat Scratch. Shut up. Wars are like bombs. Thank you, Robert. The fuse gets lit before you actually hear the bang. And sometimes the fuse can be pretty long. Did you know I was from the border world, sir? Die! Oh, no. Figured you were Terran born, if anything. Terran educated. But my parents were third generation border worlders. I guess I'm just having some problems with these missions, sir. On whether they're right. Who are you to question Confed? Shut up! Who's he to question Confed? <laughs> I will not be lectured on the military procedures by a border world scumbag. If you start second guessing every mission you fly, you're not gonna last long out there. You signed on to fly for Confed. I think an oath of loyalty should mean something. So shut your whore mouth. But, 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 okay. I'm gonna sit my cocoa. I'm so lonely. That guy's frozen in time. He can't move. He's totally paralyzed. Ah, oh, those stairs kill me every time. Maniac. Same to you, buddy. Same to you, buddy. Ah! <laughs> so some of these guys, not exactly friendly. Nah, forget it. Hey, <laughs> Woo! Convergence chemist. Was she friendly or uh, friendly fire? <laughs> well, um... Attention. All personnel without level 5 security clearance, leave the flight deck immediately. There will be no... <laughs> Is he speaking English? What's he saying? Pretty soon we're gonna need a hall pass just to use the head. Wonder who's coming aboard. Beats me. Well, 
I'm not feeling very welcome around here, I'm gonna go get myself a libation up at the lounge. That's not where the lounge is. Coming? That's the briefing room. The... Yeah. <laughs> So am I sticking around the flight deck and getting arrested, or uh, am I going with the maniac? I'll let you choose this one. <laughs> you want me to go with him? See, wherever I go is the lounge, because I'm always easy. Yeah, you would think I would have level 5 clearance, being a guy who's destroyed TWO PLANETS! Thank you again, Retro. Oh, hey, hey, I'm sorry, I gotta go with the mercenary option. <laughs> Retro tipped. <laughs> he bought- he bought my drink to go with Maniac. So I- I gotta- I gotta go with- with Retro Station here. I need to see what- I don't feel like spending time in the brig. Sure. Alright. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Wait. I better meet you up there. I just I realized I don't go to the bar with buttheads. Guess the old man wants to tell his best pilot. Au revoir. All right. But any biochemists on their own or mine? Woo! Oh, and he's there. It looks like Eisen shot him down. Woo! Eisen hey, dumped me. There you are. Orange whip, orange whip. Two, two orange whips. Well, compliments of the maniac. What did I do? Win the lottery? Hmm? Oh, get one for me. Next time. So, how did it go with that biochemist? Struck out, Colonel. Big time. That McFly kid well, punched me in the face. You always say there are other nuggets in the asteroid belt. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Hope so. He just found out there wasn't going to be a Back to the Future Part Four. Hey, Colonel. Did you like being on the farm? It had its moments. Yeah, someday, huh? I gotta piss. I I just remembered something I gotta do. I gotta make like a tree and yeah. See you around. Something's troubling maniac. Colonel Blair, report to the briefing room immediately. This is an emergency. Uh, I think I'm in trouble. I didn't do nothing. Colonel Blair, report to the briefing room immediately. This is an emergency. Today! Gentlemen, Yo. we have a critical situation. Captain Eisen has stolen the shuttle and fled the Lexington. There has to be some explanation. We have reason to believe he's been feeding information of Border World's intelligence these past weeks. That's why he was relieved of command. But we had hoped to bring him in quietly and simply pull the plug on his indiscretions. My guess is he knew we were on to him. Is Captain Eisen piloting the shuttle? Unfortunately, the captain seems to have enlisted <laughs> the aid of Major Todd Marshall. Maniac? You talked Maniac Gentlemen, into this? I know cool. This is difficult since you are old comrades, but this is a deadly breach of security. If the current tensions erupt into war, the information Captain Eisen might have could do us serious damage. The Confederation has never needed you more. Ah. Uh. Unfortunately, his destination is still undetermined. These are your wingmen. Your ships have been trapped. An ordinance has already been committed. You must bring William Eisen back. Sir, if Captain Eisen's already taken these steps, I doubt he'll come back willingly. Use any means necessary, Colonel. Captain Eisen Beg. must not Cry be if you have to. This system. He must not be allowed to rendezvous with border world forces. Dismissed. You need a drink, Leo? <laughs> Jeez, go! Go! Bunch of assholes around here.
Okay, so this is the moment where I have to decide whether or not I'm going to go with the captain or not. Minor major spoilers, but this is a fairly significant decision that changes the course of the whole game. That's the price of freedom? <laughs> See, I don't think I should be following Maniac's lead anywhere, but... Oops. I can't trust Malcolm McDowell? Oh, who says? Renegade option. I'm not firing on the captain. I'm going with him. You with me? Fight fight. Shit! Holy shit! I'm with you too, sir. Miner! You are fast! Girl! You better follow us. Otherwise, you'll miss the boat. I'm sorry, brother! Ejecting. You wanna see something fucked up? Thank you, Retro and Wesley. I can't see exactly what's going on. See that right there? See this? That's Miner. That's Miner right there. How you doing, Miner? Bye bye. Oh my God! Oh my God! I've never seen that before! Oh, Jesus! Wow! Oh, my God! <laughs> uh, guess Paulson ain't gonna let us just waltz away. Oh, man! Hippie! No! Not you two! Break and attack. Go for it, Colonel. Break and attack. Time to earn my pay. Oh no! That's horrible! I am shocked at my fucking core! Bye bye, hippie! Get a haircut! Come on, man! Bonk! Quality! For whom the bell tolls! Oh! Oh, Lord! Man, that was his inner skeleton. <laughs> oh no, there's another one! Oh! I didn't do that one. Things just got bloody in a hurry. That guy was dead already. I didn't do that. Why didn't you ask me? We're landing on the BWS in Trevin. Now, I don't think you'll get clearance going in the other direction. Make it quick, too. We're dropping out as soon as you land. Thanks. Yeah, no problem, pal. What's your status? Well, we got a scratch or two. 
Jesus. That was intense. Hurry! Run! Go faster! Yeah, where the fire is. Got it. Let's get this thing out of here. Come on. I'm proof. Boy, they took a lot of hits. Hey, that's mentally challenged foam. Be taller. Stay right there. We got some problems to take care of. If you can direct us to Captain Dominguez, he's expecting. Captain Dominguez was on the bridge during the attack. He's up there. And he's over there. Anybody on the bridge or in the bays didn't survive. Two thirds of the crew. Captain Dominguez did brief us on your possible defection. Your deal is with him, though. We got to talk things over with the crew. Before you guys get too cozy, understood? Is there any place we can get some lunch? We'll finish this later. Uh, maybe bad time. We use some extra hands. I fought with Captain Dominguez 40 years ago during the Venice Offensive. We conquered Italy? Now he's dead at the hands of one of his own? What, what is all of this coming to? I was hoping you'd be able to tell me. I've turned my back on Confed. All my stuff's back on the Lexington. Paulson well, said you were... You were a spy. <laughs> a detective, maybe. They were feeding us a lot of bogus information. The last couple of days I've been checking out mission data. Coded transmissions. Fleet movements. I've got all the information right here. This could stop a full-blown war. This is my book I'm writing. But you don't know what it means? Well, some of the pieces are missing, but what I do know is this. This clash between the border world and Confed is being provoked by certain elements within Confed. I'm sorry. Why didn't you tell me? Because I have no idea who they are. What? But you had no problem talking maniac All into I it. Was that my defection could end up being suicide <laughs> He's too stupid to be part of a conspiracy? Is that what you're telling me? <laughs> you had to decide that for yourself when the time came. I made my choice, sir. I have no regrets. Well, Colonel, I hope you never do. I guess they're probably going to take your farm. Get up top, see if they ain't have them. Yeah, I'll lend out a hand down here. Attention! This is a scramble. Looks like the Lexington followed us through the jump point. Incoming fighters! All pilots up! Repeat, all pilots up! We ain't out of the woods yet, people! Thank you, Axel. I better save under a new file. Attention! Yeah, yeah, I heard you the first time.
Give me a damage report. Yes. We are safe for you, sir. Wow, you seem a lot Come happier. On, take it like a man. You're dead now, Slime. This is gonna get ugly. Shit. Ow! That was me. That was all me. <laughs> that really hurt, by the way. Ah, here come the bombers. That really hurt. Come on, take it like a man. Ah, hell, Oreo's trying to get my attention. She has to go bathroom, I think. Oh! I think I actually did succeed in pissing him off. Jesus Christ. You won't see tomorrow. Prepare to die. Ah. Oh, he mad. Unfortunate. Retirement. You realize those guys have torpedoes, right? Start shooting. Ah, I am good. I'm almost out of boom rockets. No, oh, yeah, I'm out. Well, they really sent the whole house. Ooh, are we clear? Ooh, we're clear. Need clearance. Hey, nice work, Colonel. First Lieutenant Valina Sosa, I run the switchboard here. And you are clear to land. Clear the deck! Thank you, Trush. Oh man, yeah, that that missing wing was when I hit that first guy. That that hurt a little bit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, I will be right back. Uh, Oreo, I believe, needs to go potty. So, bio break, I suppose. Stand by.
Guess what, Oreo? The entire world just saw you sniffing your crotch. <laughs> She's taken over my chair. Was there a shadowy figure on camera? <laughs> I don't know if you're being serious or not, because if you are, that's going to freak me out now. <sighs> oh, Vigo? I had to check. Well, if it ain't the new con-fed flyboy. Fighting on our side, huh? Yeah. Name's Flair. Well, hooray. I'm your replacement, Wilfred Brimley. This thing after all, right? <laughs> Welcome aboard, kid. Chief Tech Robert Sykes. <laughs> but you can call me Pliers. Thanks, Pliers. I haven't seen one of those birds in quite a while. Not up close, anyway. Yeah, I bet you worked on plenty of them. Oh, yeah. I used to pull kill rathy whiskers out of the intakes for kids like you. <laughs> you want a rat to chew on? Yeah, I could do a few things with that, baby. Hey, don't let these gray hairs fool you, kid. I can still perform miracles with nothing more than a socket driver and a pile of junk parts. Looks to me like you kind of have to. Have you met yeah. my robot woman? Plus, I could tweak those birds way beyond the specs those egghead engineers come up with. Bet this old coot knows what he's doing. Well, oh, great. I can use all the help I can get out there. No. Well, just wait and see what I can do, kid. Trust me. Believe it or not, Leandro, that is not a green screen. They built real sets for this. I I promise you. Yes? Well, not the whole ship, but... <laughs> Whenever there's actors on screen, that's a set, for the most part. Hey, at least there's table space in the galley here. He is the old guy from Office Space. <laughs> Is this really a design to be doing your calculus homework? Pull up the chair. I think I already have Lieutenant Sosa. Oh, sorry, sir. What you got there? Uh, well, look at me. I'm I'm stuck in the Stone Age. I mean, so much of our equipment is down. I've got to resort to prehistoric tools in order to decrypt this info Captain Eisen brought with them. Oh yeah, yeah. People forgot all about pencils. You have a talent for decoding. Well, um. Yeah, sir. I mean, I I don't mean to brag, but I'm definitely one of the best. Wow. Anything there? Plenty. It's just going to take me some time. One thing's for sure. Confed definitely has a lot of skeletons in its lockers. So what do we got to eat around here? Cornbread and cornbread and there's, there's a lot of cornbread here. Waiting in line for the bathroom. I say we just cut our losses and pull back. The jump point is the quickest way out of the system. It's way too obvious. I say we stay and hurt the Lexington as much as possible. Or I am manly. Confed too. How long have they been carrying on? That like doesn't this? make any sense. Too long. There's something you don't understand. It's typical. typical. I am a man, and you're you. You're both right, and you're both wrong. Attacking the Lexington is a waste of valuable resources. Beating a hasty retreat is a wiser course of action. The jump point is the most obvious exit route. The Salinas Nebulas might be a better way out. Either way, I don't think the Lexington is going to just let us cruise away. I'll bet you'll get a chance to inflict damage on her or sustain more yourself. 
I guess. What do you think, Colonel? I think this ship needs a captain. I was talking about me. No, I, I really was. I'll do the best I can. I, I, all right, do worse. The size of that key. Happy to see you back where you belong. I guess you need a key that Thank big to start Colonel. a spaceship that big. You had no small part in it. Well, to business. As you know, to avoid further harassment, the Intrepid's going to try and make its way out of this system through this nebula. I'd like you and a wingman to scout ahead, clear the area of any hostiles you might encounter. Understood. Sir. That's not a Good nebula. Luck. That's cotton candy. I was able to pull a storm fire off a junked pirate fighter we just hauled in. Boy, old technology, but damn effective. Fires a shitload of small, low-density projectiles at extremely high velocity. Just paint your target and let her rip. If the range wasn't so damn short, they'd still be around today. Try it out and see how you like it. Oh, I hate the Border World ships. I don't remember much, but I remember that. The Banshee is armed only with, with laser cannons, and in the Wing Commander, universe, Wing Commander universe, the laser cannons are just pitiful. God, every time that gets me. I haven't taken any of the main cast members out yet, but, uh, Excel. Hello, Jen. Moose. <laughs> Moose. Uh, why do they call you Tex? I'm guessing because he has a Tex in it. Uh, how would you like to be on this ship and see your profile on this computer that says uh, your aggressiveness is medium, your courage is high, or like, you know, Major Todd Marshall, courage low. It's, it's, it's official on your, on your transcript here. You're a big pussy. Blade. He looks so old. I'll give this a try, but I hate these ships. And also, I hate Nebula missions because everything is fucking purple. Now, it does have other, sh uh, other guns. It has the Leech Gun, which I've never used. And the Scatter Gun. I'll try the lasers for now. No, 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 no. It's going to be purple in a second. We are now entering the marshmallow. Break formation and open fire. Taking it to them, Colonel. Taking it to them, Colonel. Whoa! Just like I thought. A newbie. A newbie? I've killed planets, boy! Whoa! Thank you, Kretz. I can't read your name. Thank you! See what I mean? Blade's gone! Come on! Just like I thought. Ah, hell. Jesus. 
that's the scatter gun. Woo! Missiles work. What sucks about these dudes is they have turrets in their butt. Oh, that worked. Hey, result. Uh, Blade's dead. I need a new guy. Shit. I have not tried any VR stuff. I'm sorry, no. You pathetic descendant of monkeys! Whoa! Four of them? Jesus. Boom! Oh, hell. Getting a little hairy. Oh, God, the lock on takes forever. Bam! Gotta save my missiles, though. Come on, die! Shit, shit, shit! Ah! Oh, hell! Oh, I'm hurting! little bastard. For Miner! This doesn't give you the lead, the, the lead tracking system, the alternate guns though, to, to lead a target, so I have to guess. Come on! Come on! You're annoying me! Force is strong with this one. I have you now. I don't think so. Oh. Enemy near. Autopilot not allowed. I sense more. Oh, hell. Oh, four of them. Man. Ah! Woo! I'll try spinning. That's a good trick. Whoa! 
acid, Biggs, where are you? Excaliburs? Oh man! Four of them! Three of them, whatever. You're nothing but gutter dogs, border worlders. Two of them! Whoa! Those are like the best ships in Confed. Be a shame to break them. Ow! Oh, that was me. That was all me. And, and I don't want to start this over again! The tiger was killed today. Once considered a hero for his exploits in the Karathi War, he had recently betrayed the... Oh. That was my... That was a dumb mistake I made. That was just dumb. Damn it. Dumb mistake. Victims in sight, Colonel. Break formation and open fire. Taking it to them, Colonel. I get mad at myself for doing dumb mistakes like that. I did not. I guess I did. Made another dumb mistake. Up. Blade! I stuck up for you! Jesus! They go too slow! Ow! Ah, fuck. Sucks. And my targeting system is shot. That's good. So they have to use the force, I guess. Lost R2! Well, I don't know there's enemies because my targeting computer's fried, but the music got ominous, so I'm guessing I'm in danger.
ow, ow. There's not a whole lot holding this bucket together. I like the spread gun. I'm doing a lot better than I used to with it. Come on. If you give up, I'll let you go. What? Charge chunks of your ass? Because that's what I'm about to do. It's always the last one. Jeez. Well, still more. Where are you at? Hi. They are real mad. Shit. Give up or die. That's two. I miss Blade. Come on. Whoa, that's too close. Come on. He actually spoofed that. Nobody does that to me. Hold still! Result? Running out of gas. One more pass. Oh, you turd! Excaliburs? I think so. Two missiles left. Not good. Jesus! Getting intense. A little bit. Bye bye. Ooh. I 
have a respect for that man. But now you're one on one with the great one. Oh, thank Christ. Oh. Need clearance. Okay. Great work, Colonel. Oh. There's been a change of plan. We've discovered a backdoor jump point that'll be easier for intrepid to navigate in our current condition. So, you have clearance. I have returned from the purple dimension. Thank you, Reggie. Thank you very much. Uh, there's no space cats in this game, at least not really. Oh, I I bent my prongy thing. Mm. Oh. Hey, don't touch my stuff. Uh, I wasn't looking at porn. There you are. Yeah. Well, don't you look like the cat who ate the canary, feathers and all. Uh, forget well, what you've seen here, kid. Right. Hey, you know those confed fighters you boys flew in on? Well, they made for a mighty fine meal. Meaning, I ate I them. Done stripping them down for parts. <laughs> well. Well, I hope you put the pieces to good use, pliers. You can bet on it, kid. <laughs> I'm gonna weld this ice cream. Thank you, Ruben. Uh, yeah, I played the Mech Warrior games. I only really remember one. It was uh, Mercenaries, I think. used to be up there. <laughs> Births were farther up. <sighs> Poor bastards. Thank you, Steven. Never knew what hit him. At least when I go, I'll be in a cockpit. Oh, come on, cheer up. I still say it'll be friendly fire that gets you. <laughs> I should know. I plan on it being mine. The side we picked to be on. Thank you, Dry Hulk. a long, hard road ahead. Yes, thank, uh, thank Abstruse, right he found the fix. now you won't have to deal with that confed promotion that finally came through. <laughs> My promotion came? My promotion? Confed, I, that's not right. Butthead. I found this skull in the barracks. Nice. Very nice. Gentlemen. What's that Welcome smell, gentlemen? <laughs> promise first class accommodation but then again i do get my own room i'm in charge don't take offense sir but how can you make jokes an hour ago i was a confed pilot now i'm shooting them down what's going on what are we doing here we're trying to make things right i don't know what the rules are anymore well, you know cat scratch life isn't a flight sim i think you're gonna learn the rules keep changing just hope we did the right thing partner if Confed gets approved to really go after the border worlds, this thing's gonna get ugly. <laughs> it's putting it mildly. I'm talking John Reese Davies in a bathing what you suit, ugly. More important than any flag, we gotta stick with the guys we can trust. And Eisen, he's one of the few. Well, I'm gonna go to my much nicer room. Bye. <laughs> so I hear the Dharma Initiative's hiring. I wouldn't be surprised if Paulson is steering for us right now. 
so I think you should take one of the Avengers up on this mission. Uh, I want Thor. He's now, the strongest only Avenger. Our hope of escape lies in this back door jump point. I want you to take three wingmen and escort us the hell out of here. I am terrible at this job. Good luck, kid. Eisen handed out a tough one today. <laughs> Sucks to be you, kid. I got three wingmen. Cool. Well, let's take Chuck Yeager. Turbo. And Blade, you're off the team. Primate. B team, B team. Oh, Stormfire, I got a machine gun. Cool. Break formation and open fire. Yeehaw, here I come. Break formation and open fire. Firing away, Colonel. Break formation and open fire. Maybe I'll just negotiate with them today. On second thought. Don't get sentimental on me, Colonel. You know what you have to do. Kill them! If the Lexington gets to that jump point before we do, it's all over for us. Fry them like you fried Miner. Whoa! One more for the kill board, eh, sir? Enemy target destroyed. Jesus. Hey, you want to see something? I'll show you something. In a second, I gotta get there. This thing's slow. You know what, Goose? I think it's time to buzz the tower. Seems changes depending on what I do. Oh well. Bye-bye! 
I just blew up all my stuff again. Yeah. Oh my god, what a disaster. <laughs> You're in so much trouble. The mistake was in not killing him right away. Who? Eisen or the Colonel? Take your pick. I'll be in the head. What's going to happen now? It's a good question, Captain. First of all, I'm gonna get reassigned. Oh! I'm gonna continue with my plans. With the added pleasure of killing the heart of the tiger. <laughs> <laughs> You're stuck here! What are you looking at, soldier? Nothing, nothing. I just, just fight. He's bleeding all over the leather. Oh. Uh, <laughs> technically, I was on Babylon 5. <laughs> I really should have come up with a knife pun before I killed him and laughed. Uh, oh, well. No, no part, no, no fun today. Oh. Come on. What'd you do? Ah, you see, sir, there it is, right there. Yes, Lieutenant S. Yeah, but I can't get my Wi-Fi to connect. The holes in the data are confiscated from the Lexington. We've got no confed transmission data for a specific 18-hour period. Before and after that time period, confed undertook operations which seemed to relate to the chemists in the lab we confiscated. Benghazi. That com data, we can't make a firm connection. We're missing carrier group trackings, fleet movements, assignment logs. Well, that was your oh, deal! Ah. Oh, I've got it. There's a Confed comm station right here in Orestes, orbiting the system's outermost planet. Oh, sure. Most of Confed's comm traffic must relay through there. Mm. Helm, set nav coordinates for Orestes 9. Aye, aye, sir. Start the vehicle! Going on the sky. Sir, 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 sir. sir. So, you're one of the only women on board. You look lost in your thoughts. How you doing? It's never gonna end, is it? What? I spent seven years fighting the Karathi. And then I thought it was over and humanity was united, right? Now I'm taking aim on people who used to be my allies? Come on, Colonel. We're just pilots. We don't get to choose the enemy. Good night, Robert. Become a flyer. I ran away from home when I was still a teenager. Fell in with some privateers. That sounds sexy the only as good hell. The thing to come of that was learning to fly. Signed on with Confed when the Clarathi moved in on my home system. How about you? Yeah, I uh, thought I could stay away, but this is all I know how to do. We are smart well, people. Well, you know how to farm. I should Maybe. be able to think of something better to do than all this killing. Imagine all the people. She's dreaming. There's nothing else but killing each other. Yeah, you'd think. <sighs> There's time. This isn't going to last forever. So you believe that the good will win? Bad touch. Of course the good will win. I am the good. I'm afraid we have to postpone our plan for a comm station at arrest is now. Oh, but you promised! We just received a distress signal from a border world's convoy. It appears that they ran afoul of Confed's interdiction edict. Whose fault is that? It appears that Confed has entered into the border worlds to pursue them with a frigate and a destroyer. Proceed with all due haste, Colonel. That convoy needs our help. 
Right away, sir. That is a highly priced convoy full of rubber dog shit. Don't screw this one up, kid. Looks like a cakewalk. Cakewalk? It's a friggin' a destroyer. Good God! From Veruca 3. Hey, let's take a look at the kill board. I've only been here a day and I'm already... How does Maniac have four kills to be? Bullshit! See about that. Yeah, I'll well, see. I'll fix your wagon. What's this? A damn convention? Break formation and open fire. Gonna kick me some confed, but. Cat miss. Not a cat miss. Thank you, Thomas. I've got cat misses to get. Ah, uh, must go faster. Uh, I'm not gonna get there in time. Mayday, mayday. Shit. Uh, I was all over that, but, uh, guess not. Got that one. Oh, ow. Well, Excel just bugged out on me. Ah, oh, hell. Ah! Ejecting! Thank you, Jake. I don't know if your defection has rattled you, Colonel, or if you just finally lost your nerve. But this has got to stop. What Understood? The, the Border Worlds doesn't have the kind of inventory where you can just bail out when things get a little tough. A little sympathy, pal. Sheesh. It's a TARDIS! What is this? One of our MIPS? MIPS? Men in Man plastic. Insertion pot. Little gimmick I stole <laughs> about a year ago from some confed testing site when no one was looking. <laughs> I've got a man insertion pod, but it's not that big. It takes them guys forever to release new technology. But with all their red tape about safety and stuff. Oh, oh! Definitely not for claustrophobic types. Found the smell. Oh, it's a snug fit. But it's just a thing for squeezing folks into a spot where a shuttle might be too big or attract too much attention. You need to lube it up real good, See though. That? Latches right onto the target. Then laser cuts a hole so the guy inside can crawl right through. It's, it's like the Kool-Aid man. Just like firing an MREC. Of course, the fellow in there has got to release the safety first. Got to remember the safety word. he's pretty much on his own with minimal steerage. No air. Minimal. Enough to dock at the target and then fly back out to where you can tractor him in. And it gets pulled right back to one of your hard points. Yeah, I bet it does. You can fire it again if you need to. <laughs> Great. Just don't go crap in there like the last I'm guy. Show you something else. Don't let him pull it into your hard point. Yeah! This is my wall of sound. You know how the Kilrathi always had us beat on cloaking, right? 
And along came the Excalibur. Don't touch that! I never got my hands on one of those. But I've been putting two and two together in my leisure time, and I came up with this little thing. Ghost containment unit. Now, I won't give you a complete cloak, but it should be pretty effective in hiding you from the radar. Uh, I wouldn't Any get that sense? close to it. Well, nothing's perfect, right? There's the massive gamma radiation leak. Number one, it runs on a very rare crystal. It's got a short half-life. So it, uh, it could burn up pretty quick. That means you might come out close to <laughs> <here. laughs> Potentially inconvenient time. With your pants down, with the cops around, uh, at a two. playground. I only got one of them. And a wingman who ain't cloaked won't do you much good. No, I know the Vanisher. He's over so there. If you want to use it, you got to fly solo. Bing! Thank you, Jassichin. One of your Cyberpunk 2020 players scored a headshot with a 5d6 damage rifle. Huh. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Why well, roll damage at that point? Of course, I ain't tested it yet. There's an 85 percent chance it'll kill you. 90 make you sterile. This thing could be very useful. You gotta keep the mad scientist on your side. Get it ready, pliers. Might come in handy. <laughs> I can't wait for Maniac to try it out. You got it, kid. Sucker. I better save after under a new file after I'm a massive failure. Well, we found the rest of the crew. Well, that's a bold play cotton. Let's see how it pans out. All right, Rag. Vag? You're back. You got any fours? All of it. <laughs> he goes for all of it. All right. 75 cents. Full house. Aces and eights. I got four queens. Four queens! I never win! <laughs> on toast, buddy! Woo! Yes! You who's on me! Afraid not, partner. Just got hit with the foreshadowing train. <laughs> Nobody is! My ship has come in. Lady Luck is my bride. The lucky girl. Maybe I should have been. That's about the, the only girl alone. you're getting there. This can't be happening. You never lose. You always okay, cheat. Next. Oh, come on. I got two dollars burning a hole in my pocket here. Yep, that was it. Yeah, notice the foreshadowing that not only did he lose, he has the dead man's hand. Do you notice that? Yeah, aces over eights is the dead man's hand. It's a the dead man's hand is kind of a urban legend. It has to do with Wild Bill, Wild Bill Hickok. He uh he was playing a guy at poker, and the last hand he got before he was shot to death was aces over eights. Telling you, Colonel, we're so close to that missing data, I can taste it. I'm ready to go, sir. Yeah. Waterworld's That'd be funny. Vagabond's like, well, I'm retiring today, so. But they won't arrive here for another 16 hours. I, I don't just think made we it. Can afford to wait. We're pushing our luck as it is. Now, the target is this orbiting. Yes, that's station. why that game is called Aces and Ace. That's exactly why. Now, here's our problem. A radar boy, which will undoubtedly ring alarm bells across the system if you don't take it out fast enough. I hope you talked to Pliers about his cloaking device. I hope you didn't laugh at him like you usually do. Pass those turns and quickly take that boy out and make our delivery. Delivery? 
Well, as you know, Vagabond's had some espionage experience. He and Lieutenant Socia here have volunteered to go in. We use the insertion pods to get them in. Approach the comm station, fire them up. Point, point. They'll dock, get the data, and then you pull them out. Because of the clandestine nature of this mission, you'll have to fly solo, understood? Okay. Completely, Captain. Who's my wingman? I hope so, Colonel. Because without that missing data, we have nothing. Good luck, Colonel. All right, climb into your booth. When you've got a lock on you, you drop the decoys, you hear me? I'm tired of rebuilding ships just because some idiot pilot wants to save his ECM pods. We got enough P-22EF and... I get it! Interference alloy. Now, as you as you watch this, just imagine uh, Vagabond and Sosa in their little pods getting knocked around as I'm taking high G turns. Okay, so activate cloak. I hope I know the right key. I did. I'm Wonder Woman. Uh, not the torpedoes. Yes, this. Everything's all monochrome. Hold on, sir. Not ready to launch, sir. What do you mean you're not ready to launch? Oh, you fucked it up! Good job! Great. Not ready. You had the whole trip! I have to go potty. Oh, hell. Jesus Christ. I am not having a good day. I ask you what the point of the cloaking device was. The notorious heart of the type. What was the point of that? No, I didn't forget to kill them. You said you were ready! You said you were- Ugh. Ah, no torpedo lock. This is what I get for trusting that old fart. I'm not picking you up there, dude. Ah, crap. 
That's the guy who has hit me with missiles. Dickhead. Get over here! Tailgating, I see. Oh, you turn like a school bus! I should be methodical and take out the turrets. Short range guns I got though. Enough of them. One more. I don't know if I'll play Death Stranding because I don't know when it's coming out and I probably won't buy it anyway because I can't afford it. I never played Earth Siege. No, I'm sorry, man. But thank you. All right, are we ready? Is your makeup done? Thanks for the ride, partner. Good luck, motherfucker. Only a few contacts in here. Probably hide under the desk when they see our guns. <laughs> Should be easy as hell. <laughs> I'll see you soon. Uh, I'm not gonna die. <laughs> We're in. But things have gotten complicated. Really? Way. Our intelligence was kind of. Oh, come on! They're in here. We're going into some well-armed guards. Guns are Kimbo. The pirate, the new Missy Elliott album. Go! Come on! Mm, uh, uh, Namaste. Hey, uh. Yeah, but hey, wait, Vagabond! Thank you, Tigor. I hope I remember how to use the tractor beam. In fact, I'm pretty sure I don't.
guess we'll find out. There she is. There's her little phone booth. Uh, it's probably in my rear turret. There. It is. Good. Hope this doesn't kill her! Oh, I know why. The F1 key is 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 hot key to mute. I'm sorry about that. It's F1. Need clearance. You're clear, kid. Bring her in. here to say goodbye to Lieutenant Winston Chang. And this box of his stuff. This was a man who flew with his heart, as well as his mind. You know, I consider myself lucky to have flown with him. And even luckier to have been his friend. But I think we all knew who, know who to blame for this. Vagabond, may your spirit continue to roam the stars. It's lighter than you'd think. It's empty. <laughs> it just drifts into the wall. <laughs> I keep, you gotta push them harder. No, they set their phasers to stun! Twinkle. Do you want to watch a movie? Your presence for the christening of the Vesuvius will be a great inspiration to her crew, Senator. What? Uh, she's a bonny ship. <laughs> Tell me, is there news? Have there been more skirmishes in the border worlds? Border worlds. News of the worst kind, I'm afraid. Betrayal. Betrayed me. It appears that our great hero of the Kilrathi War has defected to the Union of Border Worlds. Blair? What? Defected? Don't you watch the news? I find that hard to believe. He was always a hothead, but... What on earth induced him to... What the devil is going on out there? The intelligence I've collected is erratic, um, unreliable. Things fall Fox apart. News. The center cannot hold. Mere anarchy is loosed upon the world. The best lack all conviction. That's great. It starts with an earthquake. Birds and snakes. Whilst the worst possess a passionate intensity. Airplanes. Yates. And you have no idea who is behind all this. It's not me! Well, one thing is clear, Senator. The Border World's militia grows increasingly more aggressive. A grave mistake. I never knew Blair to be rash. Betrayal is always a mystery. Like evolution. Well, we are running out of time, Admiral. A declaration of war against the Border Worlds has been laid before the Assembly. The vote will be in seven days. The outcome of that vote will largely be determined by your report. Oh, I have to write a report? Oh, crap, I didn't study well, at let's all. Let's hope that war is not our only option. <laughs> I mean, yeah, right. Gonna punch players in the face for his shitty cloaking device. Is it what you wanted? Well, I didn't have time to cross scan it while downloading. A lot of the pieces have fallen into place, but nothing that links Confed to any specific incident. I mean, there is some unusual movement in Confed resources, and 
Code yeah, you have to look at the matrix encoded. The then there's a the normal confed traffic. So it could look like business as usual. Well, we don't have time to second guess. If the assembly votes for war, then a lot more pilots like Vagabond are gonna die. Except in the cockpit, like pilots do. You know what I mean? Well, well. If it isn't the Jonah. Learn how to make a decent cup of coffee on this tub yet? Oh wait, Vagabond made the coffee. I mean, the aces just kept coming my way. And the four queens. You know, he was dealing most of the time. Maniac. You're an idiot. I know. Maybe if I hadn't gloated so much, you know? Shoved in his face like that. But that's not what I'm saying. You think that Vagabond lost the will to live because you beat him at cards. Good thinking. I never beat him before. It was a pretty up big upset. I kicked his ass! Hard! We've got an SOS, Colonel, from a convoy broadcasting any Border Worlds craft in the vicinity. Now, I don't know what you're going to run into when you get out there, so stay alert. Now, the convoy appears to be moving around. Seemingly at random. away from whatever is causing it grief. But they were last sighted here at these coordinates. Bring that convoy back to our location, Colonel. Yes, sir. Can, can you tell me what's on the convoy, or is it just, like, okay. I like the giant joystick. <laughs> that That's a mighty joystick. Got force feedback and everything. Bring me back a ship as clean as you did last time, and I'll show you what old pliers can do. Like what? Serious question. <laughs> This doesn't sound like a trap at all. Jeez, it's the cat! Kill Rathies! Kitty! Red formation and open fire. They're gonna wish they were never born. And pirates! Stop! Do not fire! It is we who need assistance. Please don't kill us. Please, 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 please. Kill them all! Can you cast aside the prejudices of a lifetime? I cannot! We are unarmed here. Yes, these are the bogeys we've been looking for. We are in your No hard feelings? <laughs> Yeah, pirates love attacking unarmed Kilrathi. Yeah, you got him. Not those guys. You won't see tomorrow. Boom! Whoa, that was close. More of them. Man, these pirates are, uh, are obsessed. Hey, they 
Soviet guns, they lied! Dick and Cloak! What? What? Complete my dick! gonna bounce me out to a fail screen here in a second. They're fine. They're all fine. Need clearance. Ah, tough luck out there, Colonel. You have clearance. They're oh, fine! Guess what? The Kilravi Shintar is coming aboard. Guess who's coming to dinner? I guess the Kilrathi Shintar is just a... There he is. <laughs> well, well, Colonel. I suspect there's little need for an introduction. Oh. Thanks, Colonel. Never did I expect our paths to cross again. It doesn't hold up. universe. My only regret is the circumstances that now bring us together. Since my personal Personal. We Kirathi have tried to coexist peacefully with Terran. Mayna's no, got a laser pointer. Convoy are seeking safe passage back to their new homeland in Pasquale. We have been harassed by unknown forces. He has become such a sniveling wretch. <laughs> he brought us a copy of his ship's DR log, sir. Never gonna give you up! My thoughts exactly. No. That's a spicy pizza. I've seen that before. So have I. When I first signed on with Confed, there was a rookie pilot on my ship. He's the only man I ever met who could do that trick. Only stupid enough. Name? He was transferred out real quick, disappeared into Confed Intelligence Ops. I can't remember his name, but he flew into the call sign of Seether. I could do a lookup in Confed Registry. And that wouldn't do any good, Lieutenant. When Confed Intel wants you blanked, you're gone forever. Found him. I heard some weird talk about uh, a GE program, but never found out what it was. They bring good things to life. I'd just love to get that son of a bitch in my sights. No offense, Colonel, but uh, you wouldn't want to tangle with that guy. If he was that good then... I've I blown up like two planets, decoded. Manly! Uh, this, combined with the information that we've collected and decoded, will have to be enough. We've got less than a week before the assembly votes. Colonel, I'm I will be over team. here a lot of the time, uh, playing with my ball of yarn. Don't pet the Kilrathi guy. <laughs> yeah, everyone's kind of giving him space. I never would have believed it. All those years, all those missions. I devoted my life to knocking Kilrathi out of the sky. Why don't you challenge him to a fight? And now you're helping them get home. Wait, they don't have a home. I blew it up! When I was growing up, I dreamt of nothing but fighting the Kilrathi. Now... I think Captain Eisen's making the right call here, sir. Do I look like I have all the answers? Straighten this kid out. Just the fuck up. Can't scratch. What separates a true warrior from a killer is that the warrior only fights when provoked. And what Bushido. makes a warrior human is that he helps those in need, regardless of who or what they are. What about minor, sir? <laughs> that was just for fun. A la cuisine.
dear Bethy. I write to you from the health bomb pit. Well, so you finally took my advice about finding some place to get some rest. Yeah, it's the Ritz. Hey, where'd you get the booze? Well, I'm not gonna put myself out too much on this Kilrothy foreign aid, that's for sure. What a waste. I fought those animals in the war. We'd all be a lot better off if their old kind was obliterated. Roxanne! You don't have to put on a red light. He's missing the point. Look, we right now the kill is the same as we do. The so every time we win a fight for them, it's another battle won for the border worlds. Well, you just tell me where to shoot, and I'll pull the trigger. Thanks, Hawk. I knew I could count on you. Yeah. <sighs> hey, Hawk, big fan. Get it? Because of the big fan? What? We'll be jumping to Pasquale soon. You should be safe there. As you know, Colonel, we <laughs> killed Rafi, dismantled all of our colonies oh, oh, under the terms of our treaty with the Confederation. Thus, we have no means of defending ourselves. We'll get you home, Alec. Do you have a sandbox Why I could is use? War waged upon us. My race no longer presents a threat. What happened to the Terran concept of absolution? Still alive. Most of us. Forgive me, Colonel. I am railing at the man who I should be thanking. Speaking of, do you have a scratching rail? Express my gratitude for your assistance here. Consider it payback. What is this word? Payback. Well, you may recall that a few years ago you had the chance to kill me and didn't. It's a decision I do not regret. Neither. Oh, there is one thing that you might be able to help. Oh, us now out. what? Oh, Those the pain, William. Where's the pain? It came at us cloaked. Yes. Uh, you kill Rathy always had a speed when it came to cloaking. So, if there's anyone with experience in your convoy, I got a chief mechanic that would love some advice. I know this guy. Yeah. You're suggesting high-tech payback? Consider it done. We kill Rathi are good at computers. I'll get right on it. Yes, eventually. Yeah, just put me on my next mission. Just put up me. Stop I it, Captain. Major! Sir. Go to your room. Thank you. This is it, Colonel. I'm shipping out. I got traded to a different Personal game. Living? I think it's best that way. I haven't been in this man's navy all these years without developing a few contacts in high places. When the boys at Confed see what I've got, they'll realize they have a few rats in the house. Can you trust them? What choice do I have? They have influence at the assembly. And they're the only way of our stopping the Box fly! Captain. Transcom coming in, sir. Ah, Vice Admiral Wilther. You know who this is. He'll be the intrepid acting captain in my absence. How do you do, Colonel? I must say, I have always wanted to meet you. Colonel, you all right? Oh, this <laughs> fine, Admiral. Uh, Wilford, uh, weren't you with Confed, sir? 40 years of service. Came out to the border worlds to retire. Oh, don't, don't molest but the helmsman, woman. Me to, uh, come back to work. Uh, I know the feeling, sir. You'll Stop be it. you consulting with Admiral Wilford on mission assignments. Mm -hmm. He's constantly on the move. We're lucky to have him in our system. By the way, Admiral, what happened to that squad of Marines you were sending us? Sidetracked. Operation in the Lennox system. You know how thin our resources are. They'll be there within the hour. Looking forward to working with you, Colonel. How do you hang this thing? The Admiral's not much on goodbyes. Time I said mine.
Talk to you later. <laughs> Who did that? Earl has a metal chip. I forgot my bag. Same to you, Colonel. Same Turns around, hits its head on the door. <laughs> uh, and remember, nobody follow the ship. Don't turn your head. Don't don't follow the ship on its way out. Keep staring straight ahead, guys. <laughs> nice job. I think we're being followed. Well, ships are louder in space because there's no air to get in the way. I'm in charge, I'm in charge. Everybody sit down. Everybody here? Get to it. I want to start off by saying I'm going to do my best at running things in Captain Eisen's absence. Any of you have any questions or suggestions, I want you to come to me. We'll talk. Don't Except you, Maniac. Behind my back. But just remember, I have been given the job of making final decisions. Is that understood? Yes, sir. Certainly. Whatever. All right, let's get to it then. Maniac, you're on bathroom. On one, people. We've just entered the Pasquale system. And Melek sources report that one of the Kilrathi planets, Pasquale 10, is under attack. Of course, we all know that they are not being flown by Border World pilots. Now, my guess is like everything else we've run into, it's the renegade faction of Confed behind this. Now, the hotspots are in these three nav points. I'm mm. taking two wingmen up, we're going to clear them out. Now, remember, they're in ships that look just like ours, so be alert. We don't want any friendly fire casualties here. Maniac! Well, that's it then. Dismissed. Uh, sh should, should I be doing anything? I'll, I'll just hang out here then. Good kitty. I hate when he does that. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Well, I could choose what ship I fly in, but I guess this is the, this is, it's the light fighter, you know? Guys look just like us. I'm going for it, Colonel. Give our ships back. Whoa. Whoa, there are a lot of guys here. Damn. Ah. The Avengers. Oh, I tried to stop. I tried. Ow. I tried so hard to stop. Uh, 
Oh, I was so close to stopping. So I put a big bumper on the front of my uh, ship. Like a, or a spike or something. That was mine, bitch. Oh, man. I cracked my windshield. Enemy presence detected, sir. Presence, yay! Break formation and open fire. Firing away. Whoa! Oh! That was him! And another new All him! <laughs> that wasn't my fault. <laughs> That one might be hard to buff out. Well, looks like we got quite a crowd here, Colonel. Break formation and open fire. Firing away, Colonel. Break formation and open fire. I'm going for it, Colonel. You didn't see that. I just did that to show you what happens when you do something stupid. Oh! Oh! Stop that! What are you two doing? Slow going? Wow, Cat Scratch is on a tear! Ow! Damn it! Ow! It's on beast mode, man. Enemy near. Autopilot not allowed. Enemy presence detected, sir. Break formation and open fire. fire. Don't run into me this time, butthead. Break formation and open fire. I'm going for it, Colonel. There's no way he's this good. Got him. Give me a damage report. Tip top, sir. Never better. Oh. Enemy presence detected, sir. Break formation and open fire. Firing away, Colonel. Break formation and open fire. I'm going for it, Colonel. They certainly got a lot of our ships. Give up or die. Whoa! Jeez, that guy cuts it close. Pop. Turbo is down. Whoa. I need some help here. Right away, sir. Ah. 
Wow, those turrets chew you up! Enemy near. Autopilot not allowed. Well, we made it, I guess. Need clearance. Hey! Word is traveling fast. I hear the Kilrothi down on Pascal 10 have a new Terran hero, sir. Yeah, I'm sure they're throwing parades in my honor. I'm sure I'm their favorite motherfucker now. <laughs> Yay, Heart of the Tiger! Woo! Hot Pockets! In space! Oh, gross. Oh, I. Geez. Have a seat. No, no thanks. Oh, he touched a girl. Yikes. I've been thinking about what you said, sir. <laughs> Surprised you found the time. No, honest. You were right. Helping the Karathi is the right thing to do, sir. I. I right. Have to sure you did. Yeah, straight is the operative word here. I wasn't sure about that. Oh, by the way, Colonel, have you checked out our new house guest down in the hole? I guess I better check into that. Carry on. Just not in front of me. Don't. No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we don't need that sack. They're all dead! <laughs> Light fires are masturbating! You the boss? Yeah, something like that. Oh, Lieutenant Colonel Decker and company reporting for duty. Uh... Colonel Blair. Oh, the cat killer. Hey, look, you people were supposed to be here hours ago. <laughs> well, things got a little hairy in Lennox. Speaking of which, I hear you're trying to bring home a few cats. You got a problem with that? You're looking at a veteran of Repleta and a man who escaped the Kilrathi POW camp. They took a lot of years out of my life. That war's over, ain't it? Yeah, that looks like we got another on our hands. As ordered, experts at hand-to-hand -hand combat. Uh, they don't look like much, but they get the job done. Come on, on your feet, let's go. What? What's going on? on? Ready to go to work. We're the bastards. Good. Getting prepped for a mission. We're gonna see some action. All right. Now y'all gotta cram into go. one pod. So think thin thoughts. <laughs> We're girl. approaching Melek's home, which is a Kilrothi starbase. What's their status? My attempts at raising the station have been met with complete silence. No response on any channel, sir. In other words, we don't know who or what's down there. Now, our marine contingent has finally arrived, so here's what we're going to do. I'm going to take two wingmen up, sweep the area for hostiles. The starbase is located at the second nav point. As soon as we've secured the area, we'll signal for Lieutenant Colonel Decker and his men to shuttle out and gain control of the base while we provide cover. They're prepping right now. A Melek's gonna follow in one of his own shuttles and once I'll be following we'll escort the Marines back to the Intrepid, which will be at a new location near the jump point leading out of the system. Now keep in mind, Melek, stop eating the maniac. World, world ships out there piloted by the enemy. Everybody got that? Dismissed. Where we say goodbye, Malik. Get the hell off my ship. My bride will be most interested in this new picture I will offer of a sword and a tiger.
Laser cannons don't do much damage, but they sure fire fast. Here's where we crash again, maybe. No crash. And dead. Ah. Again. Thank you, Inferno. <laughs> Ah, uh, hell. Try it again. <sighs> nope, that's it. Well, what fixed it before was apparently copying the music file from the CD, which I can do, but that'll take some time. I can, I can try it again, anyway. But, I guess this is as good a time to take a break as any. It's not Windows' fault, at least I don't think so. But is the the reason it crashed last time was the same same reason it happened this time. At least I think so. Is because it, it it occasionally loads a new like a, a new file with music, so the music kind of progresses as the game goes along. And apparently that music file was corrupted, and apparently they're all they're all corrupted. So I'll have to try it. I'll try have it. I'll have to try from all the discs, I guess. It crashed the same way into the same... Yeah, yeah. It's the same cause, I think. I do have other games. I can never ch choose which other game to play. Subnautica. I... No. <laughs> No, 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 no. I, I've got the CDs. I mean, I, th that's I, that's not really the problem. At least I don't think so. I think I've got the CDs. If not, I'll let you know. I hope it was entertaining while it lasted. <laughs> The game really gets cool, like, right after this point, too, by the way. Because that's when the there, there actually starts to be a plot. <laughs> I don't think that'll work, Ninja. I, I, I think what I, I think my plan will work. I just have to do it. Okay, well, I will end the stream for now, uh, because yelling at you guys, yelling weird games at me, is not going to help anybody's mood. Uh, but thank you for watching, thank you for the donations, everybody. I'm sorry if I didn't acknowledge you at the time. Uh, as you can tell, I get really into this shit, I can't divide my attention that well. Um, it is six in the morning here. Oh, I sleep vampire hours. Maybe I'll come back. I don't know. I'll see if I can pick a different game. But uh, don't wait up. 
but I'll I'll see if the, I'll see if copying the music file works. See you next time.